to the drawing board, it seems. Damn you, I am this. Hi, Fia. Are you enjoying your time on board? Gael, I was actually looking for you. I just passed by one of your cannons and it didn't seem up to snuff. Up to snuff? What's that supposed to mean? As in, not quite the shape the others are in. And you saw that from looking at it from afar? Well, I was sort of gazing. You shot it, didn't you? How would I shoot it if I wasn't? I'm just pulling your leg. I keep them maintained as good as I can, but sometimes one might slip. Let me check the one you mentioned. Huh. Why didn't that... The touch hole is spiked with a ball. Oh, let me fix that. Now, who could have done that? Maybe the Marley saw something. Hey, Marley. Cannoness? I've just had to fix one of my cannons. Isn't that what you always do? but that one wasn't an issue of maintenance. Someone spiked a touch hole with a bone. Spiked a touch hole? It makes the cannon unshootable. A tragedy, of course. I was wondering if you noticed someone fiddling with it? Hmm. As it happens, I did notice a couple of skeletons working on your cannons. I presumed they were acting on your orders. Ah. It's just shoddy work then, as I thought. Point me to them, and I'll talk to them right away. Hello, my friends. I noticed a bone stuck in one of the touch holes. The Marley said you worked with the cannons recently? Mm. Oh, why the face? There's nothing to be ashamed of. I can easily show you how to prevent breaking off your bones when walking on the cannons. Broken. What's up, my bony friend? Are you sad? Trouble. Motivation. He's always sad. So he's the only one who is not enjoying himself right now? No. All exhausted. Everyone's exhausted? Well, we've all been there. Look, all of you can take time off for a bit. I'll think of something that gets you back in the mood. But for now, I'll take a break too. I'll have to think of something soon though. Dear Trio, I heard it once said that all beginnings are hard. Today, I believe second beginnings are even harder. But after avoiding contact for years, I don't want to prevaricate anymore. I've avoided writing to you because I died. Your letter is coming along? Uh, yes, just give me a bit of time. Uh, and ready. I think that'll do just fine. I need to get to New Crockbury, and I'd like to go there alone, Marley. I'll have a dinghy ready for you whenever you please. Where to, Captain? Let me out. It is so boring here. You are accused of the impersonation of a commissarius. 
while the Maiden bids us all to show mercy, these charges represent the highest order of crime. Now, once again, do you confess? Let me think. No, I don't. Ugh, so much for a nice relaxing stroll along the beach. Should I send more crew? No, thank you. I'll get him out myself. It seems that his ship is stuck in a dead calm just outside the harbor. Luckily, that looks like a manageable distance to me. bother with a disguise if they get you anyway. Well, at least this exercise will be somewhat entertaining. It's rare enough that we get to be out here by ourselves. Well, no. The crackers draw them. They always for that. <laughs> <Huh? laughs> what? Don't get too comfortable. The right hand. Oh, the body measures, the mind reflects. The right's concluded. Nothing was found. Fool's prank, it seems. <laughs> Very well. Like moth to the firecracker. A little spectacle just for you. Little bombs. Home my senses. In the name of the maiden, reveal you. Yeah, I do resist the noise. A fool's prank, it seems. Very well. Another ace in the hole. This shall not go unanswered. I am a servant of the Grand. I this will occupy them for a bit. Was it a trick? Or part of the design? You won't be with us long. Canoel! I can help if you let me. I hope you don't struggle with confined. Ah! It's not ready yet. Right where I want you. <laughs> Always up there. Little explosives are just a little spectacle, just for you. Commence the right of inquiry. Maiden, the body measures this. The mind, mind shall stay calm in the face of evil. The right's concluded. A fool. You are charged seems. with the false well. impersonation of a commissarius. Oh yes, I remember now. But I must insist. I've been badly framed. I'm innocent. Better hold your breath. The landing could be a bit rough. You are still wearing the uniform. That is. I'll be cautious. Ha, 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 ha. A fine shot. This is going to marvelous. Don't mind. 
I still need that. It's not ready yet. I can resist the noise. Have you ever considered the consequences of your actions? You've interfered with the grand design. Oh, really? This one is special. Anyway. Continue your grandstanding, and the maiden will judge you here and now. Please let her. I've always wanted to meet the young lady someday myself. Where do I put this? Good guy. Different this time, eh? Oh, aren't you sweet? This will occupy them for a bit. Whoa! Always up there. This shall not this shall go unanswered. And so you the have heard your shot. Yes, you confess. In the name of the man, the landing could be a bit rough. I'm afraid I didn't listen before. Could you kindly repeat them again? Anything. Is it a trick? Finally, there you are. Oh. I was afraid I had to get out of here on my own. I would have liked to see you try. <sighs> You've got a letter for me, or is this just a rescue mission? Here it is. Very good. And how do I get on the trading vessel? I've paid for my passage, but uh, I don't think they'll turn back to harbor just for me. Ah, oh, they won't have to. I have my cattle. Ah. Uh, well, all right. I stand ready. Little explosives are just as good. Ah, words, nothing more. Like moth to the firecracker. They always for it. <laughs> so small, yet so noisy. Marvelous! I was going to clean my canal anyway. <laughs> A fine shot! Ah, no more me. It's the thought that counts. <laughs> Don't get too comfortable. going to be a long shot. The landing could be a bit rough. Whoa! Always up there. Still working now. Huh? Don't mind the 
Little Bombs. Et les camons. Yeah, I do resist the noise. I'll be cautious. But it's still going to hurt. Whoa! Ah! A fine shot! Cannon ready. <laughs> Always a pleasure. Really, cannon. I still need time. Have a nice trip! Don't worry, Gael! You've provided me with ample to read on this arduous journey! What? Uh, nothing! <laughs> I think the breeze is picking up! Looks like we're lifting anchor! Goodbye! I dare you, Aantis! If you break that seal, I'll. Oh, I'm sorry! The wind is carrying your voice away! Goodbye, Gael! Goodbye! Ah. Take care, you damn crétin! Hmm... Now, my dear Gael, let's see what you've put together here. Dear Trio, I heard it once said that all beginnings are hard. Today, I believe second beginnings are even harder. But after avoiding contact for years, I don't want to prevaricate anymore. I've avoided writing to you, because I died. As I've written before, here in the Lost Caribbean that means something different. It may be hard to believe, but I've got a huge hole in my belly and I permanently carry a cannon on my back. The cannon, however, will only shoot people. Also, I'm arguably immortal. For a long time, it was hard to imagine any kind of future together. And to be honest, it still is. But I think it was wrong to not at least include you in this discussion. I hope you can forgive me. It has been a long while. But if you're still interested in having a pen pal, I'd be happy to hear from you. Bisous, Gael. Oh, how heartwarming. Mm. Oh, there's something on the back as well. P.S. Please check the seal of this letter carefully. If it seems to have been tampered with, give Aramtis a solid knock on the head for me. Oh, damn. Um, does anybody here happen to have any wax? 